Bangladesh has seen big improvements in child nutrition in recent years. Why is this? One of the main reasons is that the economy in Bangladesh has grown by over 6% per year. This has increased households' incomes. People, and especially girls, are better educated with school attendance increasing rapidly. There is more access to clean water and toilets. Bangladeshis now have smaller families. In 1969, families had on average seven children and by 2016, this was declined to two children. Yet many millions of children in Bangladesh still grow up stunted because of poor nutrition. What are the main issues? There are still pockets of extreme poverty in Bangladesh. Levels of micronutrient deficiencies remain high, particularly vitamin A, iron, iodine and zinc. Infant and young child feeding practices are often not as good as they could be. Mothers aren't well nourished enough before and during pregnancy. And obesity is a growing health problem in Bangladesh. Bangladesh has vastly improved its food security since independence. Better farming methods have allowed Bangladesh to more than double its production of cereal grains. This increased production has had a beneficial impact on rural incomes, which may have impacted on food security. But more rice consumption doesn't always mean children are better nourished. Only 28% of children under 2 in Bangladesh are fed an appropriate diet full of diverse, nutritious foods. Breastfeeding rates are better, but recently exclusive breastfeeding rates have declined. The story on access to health is more positive and this is clearly linked to reduction in stunting. But attendance by a midwife or trained person nearly tripled over a decade from 15.6% in 2004 to 42.1% in 2014. The widespread work of non-government organizations and government community health workers has also encouraged parents to have smaller, healthy and well-nourished families. Bangladesh has also made significant progress in providing access to improved drinking water sources and sanitation. Bangladesh is one of 16 countries that reduced open defecation by over 25 percent point between 2000 to 2015. Between 1990 to 2015, Bangladesh halved the number of people without access to safe drinking water. This is particularly marked in rural areas. Changes associated with economic growth have done much of the heavy lifting in improving nutrition in recent years. However, there have been many left behind, and this means that more specific interventions for improving nutrition will be needed in the future. The real challenge for Bangladesh is now to repeat the successes of the health programs for nutrition at a community level. Thank you.